Adam, three points and three goals here at Portsmouth today. Talk us through that one from your perspective. Yeah, look, over the moon with the uh, with the three points uh, off the back of a home win last week as well. Um, can't really ask for much more. Thought first half we were absolutely dominant. Um, we've been, been a little bit more clinical. I think we're probably going at half time further ahead and potentially with the game already sort of in the bag. Uh, but second half showed a different side of our performance. Um, allowed them to have a bit more of the ball. But in, in truth, is I, I don't really think they hurt us too much. Uh, and then on the counter attack, chances to bury it, and thankfully we got a third at the end. And yeah, happy journey home. Two different sides to our performance. First half played some great football, scored two really well worked goals. Second half. Back to the wall for periods, dug in and just ground out that win and that clean sheet. Yeah, look, the clean sheet on the road is, is massive for the massive for the girls, massive for the group. Uh, you know, we we're really pleased with, with last week, but to come away and do it on the road here, uh, yeah, I think it just shows where the girls are at and, and realistically that our targets for the season, uh, you know, endless now, I think. Three different goal scorers today. That's now five different goal scorers across the first two games. Great to see the goals being shared throughout the team. Yeah, I think look, in any successful team, that there's probably a couple of scorers that, that feature on the on the score sheet regularly. But to have people chipping in from all over the park just gives us another dimension and, and hopefully another asset to go and win some games. Perfect start as well with that Hannah Blake goal and, and what a goal it was. Yeah, look, absolute screamer. We, she's got that in her locker. And we encourage her to shoot. Uh, she, she infuriates us a lot because she doesn't do it as much as we would like, but we know that she's got it and hopefully that gives her the confidence to, to do it a bit more often. It was a long journey down for us yesterday. A lot of supporters here, they made that journey yesterday or even this morning. Great to see them and get to celebrate with them at the end. Yeah, I mean, look, you know, we're, we're down here on the South Coast and to see, see the Durham fans that have travelled and what it means to them as well. Absolutely, you know, incredible support. Uh, and yeah, look, we're all really grateful that they get behind the team as they do.